if people are again considering or thinking about considering meditating, acupuncture, Tai Chi, I mean all these things that are referred to as alternatives, um, I mean is it safe to say give it a try? I mean if it doesn't work, I mean there's maybe something else to try, try the Tai Chi, try the aromatherapy, mix up a little bit of both, I mean again just uh, what would you say to people who are thinking about it at all? Yeah, absolutely. Um, when you're talking about uh, alternative medicine, I guess we, we should differentiate between you know the traditional and, and alternative a little bit in the fact that traditional medicine normally deals with symptoms. Mm -hmm. um, you'll feel a little bit better, but it's never, it's rarely, I shouldn't say never, it rarely goes to the cause of what's going on. When you get into alternative medicine, that's more of what they're, 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 they're looking at. What's causing this? Um, a new term that's being thrown out there is called integrative medicine, mm -hmm. which yes. is basically just bringing in some alternative medicines that you may have heard of, um, bringing more into the mainstream. So absolutely, again, weigh what the pros and cons would be. If it's something like meditation, there's really no downside to that and a lot of potential upside. Same thing with herbs and spices, makes the food taste better at, at the minimum <laughs> and it, it could have a lot of healthful um, beneficial factors uh, for your health.